So I'll see you guys after class. Thank you for 11K subscribers. Good morning you guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Maddie and I'm currently getting ready to walk over to the gym. It is 6.15 right now and it's gonna be a super productive day. I have three classes. The first one starts at 9.30, so I want to get a workout in before and then I have two more classes after that. And a bunch of assignments and homework to get done either that's due either tonight or tomorrow. So I have a lot to do today and I'm gonna get it started early. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I have way too many hoodies. I need to sell a bunch on curtsy, which I'm going to do. I think I'm gonna wear this one. Because it has a hood and it's like raining out right now, so. <laughs> so just for reference, I put some of this Owen protein shake in my oatmeal and then probably like a third of it and then I drink the rest of it while I'm in my class and I like start to get hungry. Okay guys, it is now 8.38. I'm just eating my oatmeal and having my chlorophyll water. I also picked up a package that was delivered um, this morning, I think, or yesterday. And I'm gonna open it for you guys on camera. It's like something I'm super excited about. I know what it is, it's a necklace from this amazing company called Julia. I'm so excited to open it. So I have a question for you guys because you seem to love my um, day in the life and I get really positive feedback from you guys but um, I'm a super like routine person and I do the same things most mornings and like most nights and my schedule is the same obviously because I'm in school Monday Wednesday Friday and then Tuesday and Thursday have the same like day with classes and stuff so like do you guys get bored because it like gets repetitive or like do you guys just like seeing what I do because obviously like I do a little bit of different things like every day but I don't know I was just like curious because I don't want it to get like repetitive because like I am in school and I'm doing the same things like every day so I don't know I just wanted your guys input kind of and like what you guys want to see I probably shouldn't be talking while I'm eating but I do plan on filming a what I eat in a day this week and I'm also gonna film a week of workouts so stay tuned for that I am now going to unbox this package that I got from Julia Jewelry and I'm literally so excited about it I, I can't even explain it. I love the necklace that I picked out and I've been looking for a necklace like this for so long. This is the brand. 
I was so happy when they reached out to me because all of their pieces are so stunning, guys. Like, wait till you see this necklace. Okay, so this is the package. You guys, this is literally so stunning. I'm trying to get it out of the package to show you guys. Thank you so much, Julia Jewelry, for sending me this piece. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. Guys, look how stunning. I'm going to put it on right now. I've been waiting for this package to get here. I'm not even kidding. Since I ordered it. not very good at putting on necklaces though that's for sure guys look how beautiful like i'm absolutely in love with it make sure you guys check them out i put the link to their website and the link to the necklace that i got down below in the description and i'll also put their website right here i'm about to call my mom and show her hopefully she answers she knows that i've been like so excited to get this package Watch her not answer. Hey. Look. Oh my gosh. Isn't it so pretty? That's beautiful. So you just got it? Yeah. I just wow. got it. I'm vlogging. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> I was, uh. I have a Celsius. I didn't stop drinking them. I just figured out that the reason I was getting sick in the morning was because of vitamins on an empty stomach. So I take vitamins with breakfast now and drink this after breakfast so that like I have food on my stomach, in my stomach before I drink a carbonated drink and take vitamins. So if you left a comment, cause so many of you did and like helped me out with that, thank you so much. So now I'm going to human development and it's a class on addiction. It's very interesting and um, yeah. It's actually one of my classes that like I don't mind going to because it's very fascinating. But I have my necklace on. And it's like raining and gross out and like Thursday, today was supposed to be nice out so like I'm kind of bummed. But you know what? It can't be nice every day so. Okay, I just got to my parking spot. So, I'll see you guys after class. Okay, I'm back. It is now, if I can find my phone, 12.25. And I'm gonna go home and make lunch. What else? Class wasn't that bad. Um, we just reviewed kind of for a test that we have on Tuesday. And then, yeah, that was basically it. We just took notes and stuff. But I'm gonna go home. Um, I have class again at two. It's 12.26 right now. I think I just said that. But I'm gonna go home. I'm hungry. Here's my lunch. You guys probably already knew what I was making if you watch my channel, but it's just, just one egg um, and then like half a cup, around half a cup, probably like a third of a cup of egg whites. Um, avocado, rice cakes, and two pieces of turkey bacon. I only usually eat turkey bacon on days that I do leg workouts because like I heard you're not supposed to eat turkey bacon every day I don't think so I just use it on days where I'm trying to get more protein. I'm making me bed. This is the reality of me trying to make my bed. It's so hard to make a bed when it's up against the wall. Does anyone agree with that? Like I hate having to make my bed when it's like difficult. 
like my bed at home it uh, I don't know if you guys can hear me at all and I'm just like screaming but um my bed at home is not against the wall so like it takes me two seconds but here it like actually takes me a minute because I have to like climb on my bed but it is important to uh, make your bed because it sets your day up for success I also just want to say thank you for 11k subscribers um, this is crazy um, I just want to say thank you so much and I love all of you guys that support me and it means honestly so much to me so like thank you so much and if you haven't subscribed I would love if you would come along for this journey but um, as you saw I just made my bed and I'm gonna start walking to class because it's kind of far it starts at 2 and I usually leave at like 1 30 but there's been a couple times or not a couple like two times where I got stuck on the other side of the train so I couldn't get to class on time and I had to turn around and walk back because the train literally will go for like 10 minutes so not gonna make that mistake again and I'm gonna leave enough time to get there so I'm gonna leave like right now Okay, I just got back from my last class of the day and I'm having a one plant protein bar. I'm gonna go to a coffee shop now, do some assignments that I have due tonight and then due tomorrow. And then I'm gonna go to Target because like I said, I'm out of like so much stuff that I need. Just like house stuff and um, food. I like don't really have a lot of my staple items. So I'm gonna do that and I think that's about it. I just wanted to share this with you guys because if you do not manifest, you need to. You need to manifest because the craziest thing happened to me and I don't I wouldn't even say it's crazy because like just manifest, please manifest. So on February 2nd, so the date was 2-2-2-2, I wrote down um, a, a bunch of manifestations and I filmed it. It's in my YouTube video called New Month Fresh Start Tips for Staying on Track, Grocery Haul, Goal Setting, and Lots of Chit Chat. I, in that video, I filmed that on February 2nd. And I was talking about how like I think that date is very significant and that you should manifest on those days, on that date. And so I wrote them down. And yet, yeah, this past Tuesday was February 22nd, 2022. So again, 2 2 2 2 2. And, um,. I went to write down manifestations again because everyone I'm sure you know how powerful like that day is and um, how like it's so important to like put out positive energy and to manifest and envision like your best self and so I was going to write down my manifestations for um, new month just I was gonna write down new manifestations and I noticed that I had written the date down the last time I manifest and it was two to February 2nd okay and I wrote the date at the top my first bullet on my manifestations because I know I didn't share like all my manifestations with you guys but my first bullet was I have 10k YouTube subscribers and at this time when I posted this video I think I had like 3,000 like I was so far away from 10,000 and like I, yeah I believed in myself but like I did not think that like this would happen so fast and that I would get 10k subscribers on YouTube on February 22nd, 2022. So like when I was going to manifest again on 22222 February 22nd, I was like holy crap, the fact that I wrote down this manifestation on February 2nd and I it came true on February 22nd. I don't know, it's like hard. I don't know if I'm saying this and it like makes sense, but like when I realized that, I was like holy crap. It's manifestations are real do it if you don't and it's so powerful truly if you truly believe that what you're writing down is possible and that like you can one day have all these things that you want and be all these things that you want to be you you really can and yeah i just want to say that that was my little rant but i just thought that was so cool okay
Now I'm gonna go to a coffee shop. Okay, I'm leaving Monarch Coffee now. It is 5.33, they closed at 5.30, so I had to leave. That dinging is so annoying, sorry. But I had to leave. Um, I finished most of my assignments, but I still have one like little discussion post that I have to do. So I'm gonna do that once I get back from the grocery store. And I think I'm honestly going to go back to my apartment and put my backpack inside and get a sweatshirt because the temperature is dropping and I'm always cold. So, I'm gonna go get a sweatshirt and then we'll be on our way. Better to have a short life that is full of what you like doing than a long life spent in a miserable way. These are the best cookies literally ever. This is my favorite flavor. Like, so good. It doesn't look like that much, but I just brought all this in, in one trip, upstairs. My arms hurt to say the least, but I'm gonna give you guys a little haul of what I got. The Quest tortilla style. Um, for a second I thought I got the wrong flavor. This flavor is the best flavor. I mean, they're all pretty good, but this is spicy sweet chili. Protein chips, 19 grams of protein. Like that's crazy and they taste good too. Then I got two candles. I go through candles in like a week. Next up, I got these paper towel um, wipes. Just so that like after I eat, like it's easy just to wipe stuff down. New toothbrushes. My keys. Almond milk. Uncured turkey bacon. Large cooked shrimp. I got siete chips. Lightly salted rice cakes. I'm so excited to try these. I'm gonna have one tomorrow for sure. Then they were out of my, the normal Greek yogurt that I get. Um, or like the, they were out of the vanilla flavor, so I tried this new brand. It's the Light and Fit Greek yogurt. I got strawberry cheesecake. Hopefully the flavor's good. And it's, yeah, 12 grams of protein. I eat these for dessert with dark chocolate chips and like I mix it in. It's so good. I got more egg whites. My favorite cream cheese ever, the Kite Hill cream cheese. I got four Celsius. I think three poppies. Chocolate chips. A lemon. An onion. More poppy. I think. Oh no, that's not it. Okay, I'm. <laughs> you guys are like I'm. I'm just piling it up. You're not gonna be able to see me by the end of this. Some ground turkey. And then they were out of the Morningstar um, plant-based like chicken patties things that I like. 
So I am trying these veggie sausage links by Morningstar. I don't know. I'm gonna try them, but they look pretty good. And then I got my Daya, Daya, however you say it, um, dairy-free mozzarella style cheese. Okay, and last but not least, I went to the Fresh Market and I got salmon and I got tea. I am starving right now. It is 7.03 and I usually like have already had dinner by this time or like I'm eating usually like at 7 but I haven't even started making and I still need to put all this away so I'm probably going to go ahead and prep the salmon and put that in the air fryer so all I have to do is um, put the tortillas in the oven and cut up the toppings that I want so like tomatoes and onions and stuff. Let me know if you guys like seeing these grocery hauls and like me cooking dinner and stuff because I feel like I do that in every day in my life but if you know me personally you know that I go to the grocery store basically every day like I am always at the grocery store I love the grocery store and I feel like I don't really buy in bulk so I run out very easily and I do eat these same things like every single day so I run out very easily I just opened up the package of salmon and realized he gave me two um, little center cut pieces and I only paid for one. He does that. He did this last time I went too. I don't, is he flirting with me? He kind of asked if I had a boyfriend like in an indirect way today. So maybe, I don't know, but I got free salmon. So I'm happy. Okay, everything is done. These are my salmon tacos. If you've never had salmon tacos, definitely try it because it is so good and I feel like no one like thinks to put salmon in tacos and I'm just gonna put hot sauce and having a poppy, of course. I'm so hungry. Let's eat. Guys, look how many steps I got today. 17,177. Almost eight miles. I did good. Clearly I have a face mask on. I did the ordinary one, like the red one. Um, I just made my dessert. And I still have to do my discussion by the way. And it's 8.38. And if you know me personally, you know I, I, I despise doing work at night. Unless I'm like studying, but like I even hate doing that at night. I like doing everything during the day so that at night I can just like chill and have like me time and watch YouTube and like decompress, honestly. Okay, as you guys just saw, I just made some tea and I finally finished everything that I had to do today. And I'm gonna get in bed and probably watch some YouTube. Um, I'm probably gonna download this footage onto my laptop so I can start editing it for you guys tomorrow But thank you again for 11k subscribers. I can't even like Believe it. It's crazy to me and I appreciate every single one of you if you guys need anything at all Don't be hesitant to reach out to me in my Instagram DMS or leave a comment down below I go through my DMS like every night and try to get back to every single one of you and your questions and just sweet comments like you guys literally make my day. I don't think you guys understand that. Like some of the comments that I get on like my YouTube videos and in my Instagram DMs are the sweetest thing ever. And I literally don't deserve you guys. You guys are so sweet. But yeah, thank you so much again. And I hope you guys enjoyed this little day in the life. And I would love if you subscribed if you haven't. And leave a comment down below what you guys want to see. I plan on filming like what I eat in a days soon. Then I'm going to film a week of workouts. And yeah, I don't really have anything else planned, but leave a comment down below and I will be sure to film it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one.